in Royal Leamington Spa. We are on another one of our fantastic little adventures. We are here at Glen Comic Con, hosted by Spa Town Comics in the beautiful world city that we are here. Um, some fantastic guests here, including John Wagner, Al Ewing, some amazing local press as well, and some small press as well. So we'll be wandering around and saying hello all day. So see you in a bit. Yes, my Kickstarter is part two of the Murder Club. Um, I've already got part one, and it's for sale here at Lem Comic Con. Um, it's a dark, twisted psychological thriller about two psychopathic kids who plan to murder and frame someone else for killing. So yeah, part one's already out. Uh, part two is the conclusion of the first story. That's uh, on Kickstarter at the moment, uh, up until the 3rd of May. And where can we find you online? Uh, you can find me, uh, my blog's at hungryblackbird.com. Uh, but I'm also on Amazon uh, and not all, all the usual places. Hi, I'm here with Nick from the Dartwood Illustration. Do you want to explain about? Your okay. presence here today at Hi, I'm Nick, I've um, come from Cheltenham today and uh, I've got two lots of uh, artwork so I've got uh, Dead All Over which is my pop culture illustration with zombies and horror and um, comic books and I've got the Dark Wood which is my book and that book is all um, hand printed and I wanted to make a book that was all that I could do myself and it was a woodcut print and letterpress and hand bind them myself at home. So where can we find you online? And online, yeah, uh, I've got Instagram, Facebook, all that. So we've got Dead All Over on Instagram and Facebook, and it's the Darkwood Illustration on Instagram for the Darkwood and my book, or my wildlife illustration. Uh, yeah, sure. Um, I do various comics from uh, Sub Diablo right through to the Fourth Dimension. Um, I'm launching my art book uh, Free Doom today, um, which is a 42 page uh, look in the Freedom Realm, and we'll be uh, exploring the Herald vs. Evil comic, which is going to be out at uh, Thought Bubble in September. It's a 52 page kind of like beat em up slash Dino esque style comic that follows a skull through a world where he's just destroying things page after page after page and levels up and joins the famous peace brigade of the Freedom Realm. Uh, yeah, that's basically that's it really. You can find me online at 4p.co.uk. That's F O R P E. Uh, So we're a company called T-Pub, we're a, a, a UK publisher. Uh, our biggest seller by far is Twisted Dark. It's kind of like uh, the Twilight Zone, Tales Unexpected or Black Mirror. If you like dark stories of creepy endings, you're in the right place. If you like happy stories of fluffy rainbows and clouds and stuff, don't, don't read it, no. Um, it's, uh, so this right now, you're if, if taking a challenge and about 90% of people who take the challenge fail it. Um, because people tend to get addicted to the stories. It's short stories that are all quite dark or twist endings, but as you go along, all the stories are actually building towards one giant ending. So if you like, if you want to have a, a story in five minutes, you can, and it's self-contained. But if you have an hour and you start reading through the volumes, you start seeing the whole overall picture. And my favorite comics are the ones I reread. These are designed to be reread, so you'll get more from it each time you read it. We recommend always your local comic shop because it supports the community. But if not, you can get it from Amazon or if you go to our website, tpubcomics.com, uh, you can even get a signed copy from us directly. We'll, we'll post it out to you. And where can we find it? Uh, tpubcomics.com. Uh, there's lots of free stuff on there. 
Uh, but in a few seconds, you'll see his result of the challenge, and you'll see whether it's worthwhile getting the book or not. Bloody hell. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. No, you're first. Okay. Uh, hi, I'm Dan Harris. I'm the creator of uh, Lou Scannon and Druid Investigations. I uh, write, co write, and pencil and ink them. And I'm an illustrator by trade. Very good. Uh, I'm Chris Carter. I'm also one of the co creators of Lou Scannon and Bruce Outback and Druid Investigations. I've done some artwork, but mainly do colouring and. Um, yeah, uh, I also colour for Transformers, Doctor Who, and a couple of other comics, and I do other freelance type stuff. And I work in accommodation also. So, yes. It's better than our last cut. <laughs> what inspired you gentlemen to set up Ashley Ooh, uh, let's cliff note it this time. Yeah. Um, okay, uh, 2011, uh, Chris did a draft for a first issue of my character. I liked it, I said, let's do it. So we printed uh, the first issue of the comic. Then I decided that I wanted to do the comic from yeah. there on. You wanted to draw your own character? I wanted could, to draw could, my own character. Crazy enough, yeah. Yeah. I wanted to draw my own character. Yeah. And um, so from there on, uh, we brought Jim in as well from issue two. And uh, you need more comedy. Yeah, yeah. And it, it need a bit more comedy. And and Jim brought the com. Jim brought the com. Yeah. And um, after years in development, we got the comic out. And from there, that led on to us doing other titles because we wanted to mix it up a bit. Uh, so we did Bruce Outback and Brew Investigations. Yep. And then we decided that we couldn't just call ourselves Lou Scannon anymore because we had more than just Lou Scannon. So, uh... so we uh, c came up with Attic Studios, partly because uh, we do a lot of uh, meetings in his attic, yeah. and partly because we kind of like the idea of like the geeks' attics, you know, storage, yeah. maybe locking them. <laughs> and we all did an animation degree in an attic. In an attic, so, yeah, yeah, we did an animation degree in an attic. Triple threat. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, you can find all the comics online uh, at uh, www.atticstudios.website, which is, I think, easier to remember than .com and .co.uk. It seems so much more forced now that we've been doing it. But, no, no, um, no, 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 no. Yeah, it's, all, it's uh, all happily improved. So, what's the Attic Studios website? Well, it's atticstudios.website. You see? It just, just rolls off the tongue. All off the cuff, this is just like... And because oh. we're on film, we can even point to the Attic Studios website there. See? Featuring such great characters as Lou and Bruce and this chap who's never forgotten. Merlin. Merlin. Well, you forget Merlin, he's the only one that isn't an original <laughs> character. You said it, not me. That's how I feel now. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, it's out there. It's modern day Merlin though. Modern day Merlin. So, um, yeah. Thanks. Cool. Hello, I'm Jim. I work on no, Bruce Outback back and I work on Lou Scannon with these guys as well. We're Joker Squad. We're um, basically a, a fan-run Star Wars in group. You can look us up on. We're on Facebook. Just do a search for, for Jokers. We do we do events all over the country. Uh, basically, put smiles on kids' faces, raise a bit of money for charity, and have a good time. Thank you for joining Geeky Brummy here at Leventon Comic Con today. A big thank you to Spa Town Comics and all the creators and people we've spoken to today. It's been great fun to be here and it's been really great to enjoy a Comic Con which is focused purely on comics. Don't forget you can find all their social media details at geekybrummy.com and don't forget you can find us online. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, share the channel. We've got some amazing stuff coming up in the near future for you. Uh, don't forget you can find us actually live every Saturday on brumradio.com. We broadcast every noon for an hour, and you can always listen again on our Mixcloud service later in the week. And don't forget the Geeky Brummy podcast. We're also on there and on all your social medias to find us at Geeky Brummy. Thank you for joining us today, and we'll see you soon. Bye.